Intel 14th Gen desktop CPUs are set to launch in a few months. However, the specifications of the new products are often available much sooner to insiders and OEM partners. Benchlife media outlet, who have leaked a lot of internal Intel data before, claim to know the full specifications of the Intel 14th generation K-series processors, including the i9-14900K, i7-14700K and i5-14600K. Let's compare them to the Intel 13th generation counterparts to figure out how much better the next generation of Intel processors really is in terms of performance in games as well as professional applications. The i9-14900K features exactly the same number of cores as the 13900K, 8 performance and 16 efficiency cores for a total of 24 cores and 32 threads. Since both generations are based on the same Raptor Lake architecture and Intel 7 process node, the performance increase has to come from somewhere else. Thankfully, it appears that Intel managed to squeeze out a higher core clock frequency from this old node. According to the Benchlife report, the 14900K has a 6 GHz core clock boost, that is a 0.2 GHz uplift over the 13900K. By the way, that is the same boost as the 13900KS, so it is reasonable to expect the same level of performance unless the 14th gen comes with a better memory controller, allowing for a faster DDR5 memory to improve performance a bit more over the 13th gen. The 14900K efficiency cores are also getting a core clock increase from 4.3 GHz to 4.4 GHz, which should help achieve higher multi-core performance as there are 16 of them. The i7-14700K is actually the only CPU getting a noticeable upgrade as it features 8 performance and 12 efficiency cores for a total of 20 cores and 28 threads. That is 4 efficiency cores more than the 13700K has. Additionally, all the cores are clocked higher. The 14700K gets a 0.2 GHz uplift from 5.4 to 5.6 GHz on the performance cores and 0.1 GHz improvement on the efficiency cores. Now let's talk about the i5-14600K. A recent leak by Red Gaming Tech suggests that the 14th generation i5 and i3 processors are getting more cores compared to the 13th generation. However, this new report by Benchlife contradicts it, claiming that the new i5-14600K features the same number of cores as its predecessor i5-13600K that is 6 performance and 8 efficiency cores for a total of 14 cores and 20 threads. If this is indeed true, then the claims of i3 as well as other i5 models getting more cores in the 14th generation should be taken with a big pinch of salt. Just to remind you, the previous report suggests that the i3-14100 will feature 6 cores and 12 threads, which is a huge improvement over the current i3-13100 with 4 cores and 8 threads. No doubt, we will get more leaks regarding these products as we get closer to launch. So make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already to get an update as soon as more information becomes available. Now back to the i5-14600K specifications. The new i5 also gets 0.2 GHz increase to the performance core clock and 0.1 GHz to the efficiency cores. It appears that all the Intel 14th generation K-series processors are getting the same 0.2 GHz increase to their performance cores and 0.1 GHz increase to the efficiency cores, which isn't much. As for the desktop processor's release date, according to the latest leaks, Intel plans to launch the K-series of the 14th generation in the middle of October this year. Those are the i5-14600K, i7-14700K and i9-14900K CPUs. It is highly likely that we will see an official announcement during the Intel Innovation Day on September 19th. The non-K series are rumored to launch at a later date, early next year, most likely at the CES 2024 in the first week of January. Next, let's have a look at some leaked Intel 14th Gen benchmarks and figure out where the new processors will land in terms of performance in professional applications and games compared to the current generation of Intel and AMD offerings. The best example we currently have is the alleged i7-14700K benchmark. Compared to the i7-13700K, the 14700K scores 6% higher in single-core and 25% higher in multi-core Cinebench tests. 
In the CPU-Z benchmark, the 14700K managed to outperform the 13700K by 4% in single-core and 18% in multi-core tests. Please note that these are not direct comparisons, so take the performance comparison numbers with a pinch of salt. But this does provide us with a good indication of where the i7-14700K as well as other 14th generation processors may land in terms of performance. The 4-6% single-thread performance uplift is the best indicator of what to expect from the 14th generation in games. It should be able to compete with the Ryzen 7800X3D and 7950X3D pretty well. Only the price and availability will determine the winner of this battle. And from what I hear, AMD can afford to lower the Ryzen 7000 series prices further if needed. As a matter of fact, I expect AMD to lower its prices to remain competitive once Intel launches its 14th generation of processors. Unfortunately for Intel, the 14th generation will not be enough to face the next generation of AMD Ryzen 8000 series processors based on Zen 5 architecture. The company knows it, and that is why Intel plans to launch the 15th generation next year. Check out my videos about these next-gen CPUs after this one. If you enjoyed this video, then reward it with a like and let me know what you think about all this in the comments below. It was I, Vadim, until next time.